33, 33, 34, 35, 36. Hey guys, welcome to Cashflow Coma. It's a beautiful Monday morning. Uh, we're doing a one week collection day today. Uh, I have two brand new locations that have been sitting there for about a week now, and we're gonna collect and see how that goes. Stick around. Thank you, Sandy, with Prestige Vending. Thank you. down all right so we just got back from our first location um, pretty smooth had one or two minor issues nothing that we can't solve though but now we're on to our newest location and we'll get there in just a second Alright you guys, we're here at our newer location. Not the most glamorous parking lot, but it is a good location. And uh, we'll be doing our first collection of one week. Okay, well, as you can see, not all of it is, you know, um, convenient money collecting. There's a lot of laborish work in here involved. It's a great location though, I like it a lot. Um, this is my first collection from it. It's a full week now, it's been a full week. And um, they have their niche, they have, they have their items that they like, and so I'm gonna go ahead and probably fill up tomorrow or Wednesday. I'm gonna come back out here and fill up for them. All right, you guys, here's our last and final location. Uh, this is an apartment complex in the laundry room. Uh, I like it a lot. It's 
bottles, which I think is cool. I've never had a bottled machine yet, until now. Our collection, guys. There's one week of my whole round. Okay, how are they bottles down there? They look pretty good, honestly. I keep forgetting there's a monster back here. This is a, a double set, so there's like stuff in the back as well. Seems very clean. Uh, everything's in order. Everything looks good. And yeah, this is a great performer. We're gonna, now we're gonna we might put the bulk machine in today. Um, hopefully they are okay with that. All right. thing about this one is I've known the old owner for a long time and one owner got it from Sands Club in 97 and it's, it's a good one it's one of the best uh, triple headers that you can get on the market actually all right what do we got going in here we have Skittles going in let's say Oh, this one's good. Um, let's say this one. This is my first ever bulk machine, really. Wow, and that was definitely not enough, but that is okay. And then, you know, it's getting pretty close to Halloween, so we have the Halloween M&Ms. I think this is a good special end apartment complex. A lot of kids living here. And on the business side, if these bottled drinks are $1.50 and these are 25 cents, you'd hope that they spend the extra 50 cents here. Ooh, that smells good. Okay. Not sure if you 
guys would have done it that way, but that is the best I can do. I don't want to touch anything. we just uh, installed that machine the little bulk machine and um, now we're gonna go back and count I'm super excited uh, I hope it doesn't get stolen um, I did take certain precautions to kind of make sure that it, it doesn't get stolen um, I don't know how I feel about it you know kind of neutral I mean I feel good and bad about it but yeah we're gonna head back now and go ahead and count for one solid week at three of my locations with six working machines just installed the seventh all right, you guys, we're back from our locations. We did a one solid week of collections from all of our locations. Um, six machines, and actually seven now, as I just put in that bulk machine in there. Before I start, I wanna thank you all for making it this far, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, like, and share this video with someone else who would. I love making this kind of content for y'all, and I'm really excited to get into this, so without further ado, let's do this. Okay, here is our stack of bills, not counting credit card. Um, so, looks pretty good to me. I like it. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna start the counting. Here we go. Actually, I'm just gonna kinda snap my fingers la like last time and all the counting will be done. We find 86. All right, so we have $186 in bills and now we're gonna count these coins. 75, 75, 75 with that quarter dollar. Okay. And then 59.75. Woo! All right, I gotta write this stuff down. Anyways, with the bills, guys, we have $186. With all the coins, we have 75.75. And with the credit card sales from last week, we have 59.75, giving us a grand total of this week making $321.50. Damn. Yeah, I'm getting to the point where I have. Uh, I mean, that's like almost like a full-time job. That's like a maybe a beginner's job, making $321 a week. Remember, though, there are losses. There are refunds. Um, and then not to mention that you only really keep about half of it. Half of it is probably profit. The other half is due to, you know, stock and other things like that. Um, but, yeah, now I feel pretty good about it. And... If you guys want one really good piece of advice, if you've made it this far into the video, which I really thank you, I will give you one really good piece of advice. And that advice is that you can move the machine. You cannot move the location. So what I mean by this is that there, you can have a lot of machines. I was offered to buy a route once, and it was a seven machine route, um, just like I have now, actually. Some of those machines were, I can guarantee you, were not making even $40 per month. So do you want quantity or quality? In the vending business, you always want quality. Otherwise, you'll be just driving around to 20 machines making 200 bucks a month. When really you could walk to five machines and make $300 a month, I'd much rather do that. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you all get something from this. I love making videos and I love the support that I've been getting from this. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you in the next one. Take care.